Hey, are you ready to level up your business in China with Xiaohongshu KOL campaign? But feeling a bit lost on where to start? No worries, in this video I'll unlock the secret like what you should do before you actually start a campaign, how to find the KOLs, like where, and how to check their credibilities. Before we start, let's make sure we're on the same page. In case you don't know what is KOL, well, KOL stands for Key Opinion Leader. You could call an influencer, but here in China, we often use the term influencer for people who are famous for their looks or lifestyle. Like Kim Kardashian, we have another word for them, like Wang Hong. But KOL are expert in certain industry and area. They're trusted by their followers because, because of their know-how. And that's why what they say can really influence how people make decisions. Second, why Xiaohongshu KOL marketing is a real deal in China? On the one hand, Xiaohongshu is a platform where people search for product review and shopping tips. On the other hand, part of users as a KOL, spreading the word for the brand can make or break your message. Thus, finding the right KOL can make every penny of your ad budget worthwhile, as their impact can often exceed the amount you've spent. Okay, get ready for a deep dive into Xiaohongshu KOL marketing. First step, understand your target audience. Before you jump into the KOL research, you must have a clear picture of your target audience. I'm pretty sure you already have the general idea of your brand audience, like gender, age, shopping habits, interest, and income. But in this campaign, you have to refine your target audience to Xiaohongshu platform specifically. How do you do that? Research. Like what keyword resonate on this platform? Who is talking about these topics? What's the character of these people? Once you've done your research, integrate your finding into your campaign brief. This comprehensive brief should include your brand introduction, the target audience on Xiaohongshu, and the marketing message you want to deliver. So it not only grounds your campaign, but also show your potential KOL partner how to collaborate effectively. Step 2. Identify the KOL niche. Your brand has a unique identity. Make sure your KOL niche does the same. Whether it's industry niche like fashion, travel, tech, or style niche like Jake, minimalist, or edging. Identify the KOL niche that match with your brand's vibe. Besides that, the different campaign objective needs the different types of KOL that support your mission. For example, if your goal is to enhance your brand awareness, maybe you should focus on the channel KOL who is good at spreading the words via blog. On the other hand, if your objective is driving sales, check on KOL who is known for showcasing the product. Step 3. Research for the Xiaohongshu KOL There are so many different ways to help you research for the KOL. First one, you can search directly on the Xiaohongshu app using your industry keyword or brand-related term to search on Xiaohongshu. For example, if you're a jewelry brand, consider searching for women's jewelry, quality jewelry, or even niche down like a gold necklace. Then you will have a lot of KOL who have posted related content with massive impression on the feed. Second, you can visit official KOL partnership platform. If you have a Xiaohongshu business account, so-called Xiaohongshu Pro account, you can visit the official QL partnership platform called Pu Gongying. I'll link in the description. From there, you'll find all the profile of the KOL in your industry niche and their price. Xiaohongshu now categorizes industries such as beauty, fashion, food, education, travel, music, technology, business, finance, health, wellness, and more. In addition, the platform offers other filters such as KOL characteristics, like mom, pet owner, business owner, model, and more. You can also select KOL based on where they live in China, even outside of China. They include countries like the United States, Australia, Japan, Canada, the UK, Singapore, France, and more. Alright, if you don't have a business account, you can check my other video. I have a guide on how to create a pro account. Or you can contact me directly, I'll get you one. Third, besides the official platform, there are third-party platforms provide the comprehensive data assistant in the KOL selection. There are three platforms we use often which is New Rank, Chen Xiaohong, and Chen Hua, I'll link in the description. On this platform, they have like a more detailed data. You can also explore the campaign of other brands, including your competitors. You can find the number of the KOL posts of your competitors' campaign, and the result they've achieved, and what type of the KOL they've worked with. This insight can help you define and refine your own strategy. Last step, step 4, evaluate the KOL quality. Here is what you need to do. First, check on the engagement rate. The most important metrics on Xiaohongshu is likes plus saves. This number is on everyone's profile, indicating the account and content quality. I'll teach you a simple formula. The radio like plus saves divided by the number of the followers being greater than or equal to 1.5 is considered a quality account. Second, checking the content quality. Reviews the KOL's feed ensures the consistency in the content quality and the style. 
Check the recent 30 days post. Take a closer look at the QL post from the past 30 days. Check the post engagement if they are consistent or if there are any viral posts. The viral content indicates the QL has the potential to make a great impact on your campaign. Great job! After all these steps, oh you'll find a perfect KOL who is qualified and shares the same target audience and align with your campaign goal. What's next? You might be wondering how to pitch KOLs, how to negotiate, what's the process of collaboration. Don't worry, I've got all the info coming your way. Make sure to subscribe to my channel and stay updated. And hey, if you feel like these are too much to handle, don't stress, I'm here to help. Whether your brand is new to starting from the scratch in China, or you're outsourcing an experienced agency to meet your growing marketing needs, reach out to me anytime. Bye, and so see you next time.